um, you ask about kind of this current state of response and distribution. I think we are certainly um, have a lot of good news and good news comes in many different forms every day. I think the singular thing that's driving how things will shift and change is that we had two vaccines under emergency use authorization. We have a third vaccine, J&J, filing for emergency use, as well as two on the heels of that. And so in the forthcoming months or seasons, if you will, supply won't be so much of a problem. Um, clinic locations are kind of working out the kinks of registration, distribution, and how to manage. Every day we're vaccinating more people. So we've had to kind of go from zero to 60 in a really short period of time. And we're expanding strategies in terms of sites of service so where people can go as we are waiting in the upcoming months to have more supply than demand, which is an inverse of the problem we've had before. So in terms of big picture, things should be looking much more different as we approach spring and summer. So those are kind of some general thoughts writ large to set the landscape. 